Hello guys, we're welcome to... We're, we're at the Vortex Club, the end of the world. Um, we're looking for Nathan slash Chloe. I, I, I see a familiar face over there. It's, it's, it's a party in here, so that's for sure. Huh. A lot going on. Chloe's probably gonna be in one of the do the changing rooms. God, there is a lot going on. You need to find Nathan and take him down. You are energy drinks, soda, energy drinks. I know somebody has the booze. Yeah, because Nathan was drinking. All right. Yeah, let's prevent that from happening. Come on! I want to save her! <laughs> Something always bad is happening to her. humiliating moment. Thank you, Max. She didn't say like yesterday. Alright, okay, tell me. I'm surprised to see you here. Where's the girl with the blue hair? Nope. K Kate? What? I'm surprised to see anybody here considering that Kate just killed herself in front of everybody. I know. I only came because Warren was coming and I needed something else to vent about. This party is such a tribute to Kate's spirit. Kate deserves revenge. We have to make sure this doesn't happen to anybody else at Blackwell. Yes. I can tell you know some serious shit by your face. You don't have to tell me now, but please let me know if I can help. Yes. Like you helped me. Another secret agent. Nathan. Tell us about Lisa, Nathan. I have to find Nathan. Have you seen him? I really don't know, but surely in the VIP section, like it's a New York club. Thanks, Alyssa. Watch out for yourself. Because <laughs> I'm tired of watching I out. Caulfield at my side. Good luck. God damn it, she's using me. Everyone uses me for my powers. I'm so not impressed by this VIP crap. Excuse me, but I'm going in. Sorry, but this is the VIP section. Members only. Okay. okay. I don't give a shit about being a member. I just want to talk Victoria to Victoria specifically told me not to let you in. Nice try. Too bad you're not a member. Listen! No, you listen. Courtney is supposed to be the VIP gatekeeper, not me. So please go. <laughs> uh, do we have to find Courtney? I need to find a way to enter this bullshit club. If I get sick now, I can drink oh, God, more later. Exit. Um. I'd like to tear every one of these things down. Good night, sweet prince. Hello? Can you please hurl and flush already? I'm never leaving. I heart war. <laughs> for like an hour. This is my last Vortex Club party. Maybe you're not oh, the no. only one who has not to get again. sick. Apparently, Blackwell has a severe toilet paper fetish. Are we supposed to do something in there? I feel like we are. So, I'm going back in. Max, what are you doing in here? Justin. Ah, Justin. Yeah. If I uh, get you look sick pretty now, ripped already, Justin. I can drink more and later. And not happy. Why did you even come tonight? Where else could I go in Arcadia Bay on a Thursday night? <laughs> Besides, Dana is here. Just not with me. So yes, this party sucks. You could get us into Nathan. Speaking of, have you seen Nathan? 
Oh, he should be freaking out in the VIP lounge with that whore text <laughs> Poor text. <laughs> Fucking hate those snobby douchebags. <laughs> Especially Nathan. That dude is gonna go on a rampage soon. You might be right, so stay away from him tonight, okay? Spread the word. Max, I know I'm twisted, but your face looks so fucking intense. <laughs> and your voice sounds different. You okay? How about a quick dab? Uh, no, I'm, I'm cool. <laughs> dab. And I have to get going. Maybe you should go chill somewhere else. Fucking A, Maximus. You're right. I'm only torturing myself <laughs> here. Plus, I'm too loaded. Yeah. It's time to get my board and grind. No. Okay. No, seriously, I'm out of here. Oh, and everything isn't so fuzzy. Um. Oh, gross. How did this even get here? Because they're doing it in the bathroom. I don't know how, but they are. Teenagers find a way <laughs> for some reason. Uh, how? Is that a floating chair? What the hell? This place is totally trash. My god, my frame rates are so low. Brooke! Hello, Brooke. Max, I didn't expect to see you at a Vortex Club party. I didn't expect that either, but... I really need to find Nathan. Yes. Have you? No, I haven't seen him. And I'm not looking for him, so I most likely won't tonight. I just hate that scrub. <laughs> and scrub. His club. You're not the only one. Maybe this party will be the end of the Vortex Club. But now I don't have to pretend like I care anymore. Have you seen Warren tonight? No, but we're going to map out our drive-in date later. I was just talking to Daniel about a road trip next week to the Portland Art Museum. Portland? Oh, that is so cool. He needs a friend. I bet Daniel will be a great museum. Mm. I'm more into okay. science than art, but what kind of a selfish fangirl would miss a Miyazaki exhibition? <laughs> Miyazaki. Not selfish, bro. You're just trying to live your life without all this bullshit. Like all of us here. You seem so wise and kind of invincible this week. <laughs> I think that snow and eclipse gave you superpowers. Check to see if you can fly. Uh, um. I don't think having superpowers would make my life easier. Yeah, no, it kind of doesn't. With great power comes great bullshit. I don't know. It would be pretty kick-ass to battle supervillains over Arcadia Bay. <laughs> well, the night is still young, Brooke. And so are we, Max. So let's plan a drone date next week. Drone date. Brooke, Daniel, speak. Who's gonna Hi, get it? Daniel. Yes! Max makes an entrance! <laughs> I only came to the party because of you. Good. I'm glad to see you out and about. <laughs> My lady! <laughs> By the way, have you seen Nathan My lady. tonight? No, I've been hanging with Brooke since I got here. Max, are you okay? Oh my, my face god. face looks so serious. Uh, I know. I'm... I'm not in party mode tonight. You look like you're on a secret mission. Yeah. This is where it's <laughs> going to end. For Rachel's sake. Well, if you want to hang out with Brooke and me, we're here for you. Thanks, Daniel. No. <laughs> I have to stay on my mission now. Come on, all this pointless I banter. I stay on yours and become a great artist. Well, I'll I'll lady. Celebrating someday in a museum, <laughs> That's where he Adios. got his stupid thing from. It's not his own little thing, he just made it popular. Uh, see, that's the thing, no one... Okay, glow... Sticks... Um... Why is everyone worried? Why is everyone worried? Let's see, double moon? Okay, we're getting somewhere. Whoa, whoa, what the fuck is going on? Okay, okay, whoa, whoa, who stopped the music, okay? DJ, what the fuck? 
Nathan. Oh my god, DJ Jules, check me out. Hey, the party, you not. All right, now we just rewind. I said rewind. There we go. And sneak in behind the curtain. Walls, you should have built a wall instead of building a curtain. It would have been so much easier. Nathan is the Vortex Club. So his ass has to be here tonight. That VIP section is so lame. I heard so Juliet hooked up with Zachary again? She better be careful so he doesn't pull any revenge for her or something. This week. Yes, Dude, but- Yay, Max! I can't believe you showed up. Why didn't you tell me? We could have dressed up together. Really? As you can tell by my outfit, I, I was in a hurry. Yeah, yeah. where's Nathan? Have you Nathan around? Hell no, I've been dancing with Trevor. Come on and dance with us. Don't have time, sorry. Oh, look at Trevor <laughs> trying to bust a move. Yeah, white people can't dance. <laughs> it's the end of the How's world. How's the end of the world going? Great. <laughs> this has been the worst fucking week of my life, so I needed to act like a carefree student tonight. For Kate. I hear you, Dana. But I want you to avoid Nathan if you see him, okay? Spread the word. I will if I want to have fun. I still feel sorry for what? him. What? No. He needs help, but not from his Oh. Family. What do you know about his dad, Sean Prescott? Uh, rich and dickhead. Rich. And a dickhead, according to Nathan. The Prescotts can't buy a happy family or a happy club. Sounds like you're ready for a change. I don't need any club to be cool or have friends. Look at you. Yeah, Plus, I'm... <laughs> I like hanging with Trevor and his skater friends. No drama. They're so carefree. Like a plan, Dana. I'm glad Trevor is with you tonight. Thanks. The boy cannot dance, though. Look at that. I know Victoria is next on Nathan's hit list. <gasps> Victoria! Warn her? Victoria, you're pick... Sorry, Max. Vortex Club members only. Sorry. I'm on the guest list. I'm taking you off. Go fuck yourself, selfie, Victoria. I don't have time for this bullshit. Real cute, Max. And after I apologized to you the other day. Do you even have a clue what's going on at Blackwell? Kate Marsh killed herself in front of you and me, everybody here. That's not my fault, Max. Yeah. Don't like... you even try to blame me. I blame Nathan for dosing Kate, but nobody at that party even cared she was so wasted. It's a fucking party! Everybody is wasted! What do you want from me? Some humanity, Victoria. Well, you got Nathan busted out of Blackwell, so yeah. you should be happy. And I'm the only person here who cares what Nathan is going through. This is bigger than a problem, child. Yeah. I'm not perfect, okay? I'm a teenager at an art school. I'm only here yeah. to become a photographer and get famous. And Bane the teacher, so... You have talent, Victoria. You don't have to push people out of your way. You don't understand. My parents own a gallery. I know how this art game has to be played. It's brutal. Oh, come on. No, it's, it's art. You don't have to play their way. Mr. Jefferson doesn't talk that way, and... And he's famous. Yeah. On point, Max. Thanks for admitting again that I have some talent. Not that I think Kay. I always do. I don't either, but that's the choice you make. Okay, it's now. Hard to believe. Warner. But I don't always make the best choices. Do you think it's like fate we're not supposed to be friends? Not enemies. Maybe, but who says we have to be enemies? Yeah, there we go. Whoever makes that decision. That would be us, Victoria. Yeah. Well, Max Caulfield, I could always choose to let you in the Vortex Club. It's not the club I, don't I want. I think that's going to happen. But not for the reasons you think. Oh, you look so serious. Victoria, listen to me. Your life is in serious danger. I know Nathan is your friend, but he is truly unstable and dangerous. He did drug Kate at that party so he could take her someplace dark. What? Nice try, Max. 
But Come I on. don't believe you. And why would he do that? That I don't know yet. But it was enough to make Kate want to die. And I think you're next. Max, that is crazy. Nathan is like one of my best friends. Yes, he takes serious meds, but that's not his fault. Come on, really break through. Like a total freak just because he has little meltdowns. They're not little anymore. They're deadly. I, I don't care if you hate me or not, but you have to believe me. You could have been a major bitch to me when I got hit with that paint. Yes. And I deserved it. Yes. Max, I don't hate you. I actually think you're one of the coolest people at Blackwell. Weird, but cool. Are we saving I just her? I don't know it yet. Maybe I'm jealous because you don't give a shit what anybody thinks, and I do. To be honest, Nathan has been freaking me out lately. Yes. He's not here, and I haven't seen him. Just make sure you stay away from him, and stick close to your friends tonight, okay? I let you boss me around this one time. And yes, we saved her. Can go to for protection. Nice. Thanks for telling me this, Max. If what you said is true, then you be careful too. I've got my own protection. And we um, made a friend. Text me if you need anything. I will. Nice. Thanks, Victoria. We Au became revoir. friends. Arva. Oh. Chloe. How did she sneak in? Maybe there's hope yet for Victoria and me. Oxygen kit. I'm glad I won't. Are we still going to need that oxygen kit? Chloe, Nathan isn't here. Oh, Nobody has seen him I... tonight. He's definitely not upstairs or in the lockers. Damn. Maybe he's hiding in his dorm. Then let's bail. Nathan can't hide anymore. So, you made it, Max. Oh, uh, hey, Mr. Wait, what is he doing in here? Uh, are you both okay? You look like you're on a, a mission. Oh, uh, I was just looking for Nathan. Uh-huh. I didn't know you were pals with him. I haven't seen him since this afternoon. He, okay. He seemed pretty upset. I think he's still quite upset over the, uh, the whole Kate situation. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's talk later, Max. Huh. I have to announce the winner of the contest. Okay. I do wish you would have entered. You have to build up that resume and portfolio, but I know you will. Thanks. I hope so. Uh, okay, excuse me. I'm it's all coming gone. to a close. Get the hell out of here, Max. We just come out from behind the bouncer, like. Okay, okay, everybody, calm down. Thank you. Thank He's you. He's like the coolest teacher. I, it. I, think, I don't want to get in the way of the party, but it's time to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes contest. Max Falafield. Before I do, I want to thank everybody who entered their photograph and everybody who thought about entering. Oh my god. <laughs> this is the most important step in being an artist. Sharing, Sharing your, your work with, with the world. world. All of you represent Blackwell Academy and everything our school stands So I guess Jefferson isn't a bad guy as, far as, as I'm I thought. Concerned, I mean, you're all everyday heroes. Everyone makes bad choices place. in life, but And the winner is. One bad choice doesn't. Oh my. What a shocker. Victoria Chase. There's like a mixture of booze and cheers. Thank you so much, Mr. Jefferson. I don't think of her as a bitch anymore. photography that brought me to Blackwell, and I hope I can live up to your name and fame. I fame. also want to thank all the students for being so dedicated in their pursuit. And I'd like to dedicate this prize to the memory of Kate Marsh. She was the real everyday hero. Nice. Thank you. She has a heart, Back at least. Victoria won. Big surprise. I can't believe she blackmailed Jefferson. Yes, I can. Who fucking cares? Rachel is still dead, and I want Nathan's punk ass. Now. Me too. Let's go check out the dormitories. All right. I feel like enough of me derping around was enough. Let's go check out those dorm range toys. Uh, next episode. Y'all get lost in your games now and make sure when you get lost you
Come back.